All right, this is David from phonebluff.com and I'm gonna be doing a quick video on how to use Metamorph and how to flash a Metamorph file. Um, just to let you guys know, you do need to be rooted. So do that before you do anything else. Um, the next step in the process, of course, downloading the file you actually want to flash and downloading Metamorph from the Android market. And once you've done that, hit menu and then go to settings, go to applications, development and make sure that the USB debugging box is actually checked so mine's already checked I'm gonna leave it the way it is and make sure yours looks like that as well and then load up Metamorph so load it up actually I had it open in the background let me show you what it looks like when you first open it up so you get a little pop-up window saying they need to make sure that the device meets all the uh, requirements so hit start checks basically all it's doing is giving it super user permissions and um, you can hit either unzip or extract a new theme or pick an existing theme what I want to switch out is my battery icon so I have this one right now it's a circular um, icon with the percentage in the middle and I like it but I want to switch it with one that matches my theme a little bit better so I've already had it before, so I'm going to go to pick existing theme, and it's the uh, minimal mat, so I'll just hit, go ahead and click on it. It'll, it'll act the same way whether you do a new theme or an old one. It'll give you this pop-up menu, and then um, you just have to hit apply all. So I'll hit apply, and it says, are you sure? Basically, like a warning, hit continue, and uh, let it load. It could range for for how long it takes to load. It could be anywhere from 30 seconds to you know two to three minutes, depending on how large the uh, file you're flashing is. Uh, but for something as simple as a battery icon, it should take around I don't know 35 to 40 seconds. So now it's asking me to reboot. Now sometimes it doesn't ask you to reboot. It just kind of does it automatically. And from my experience, it's fine. It still works. And I've even had it get. Uh, stuck in the uh, boot up animation before I had to pull out the battery put it back in but ended up it ended up working so don't freak out if that happens to you um, but you know as always make sure you back everything up before you make any changes to your phone because you never know what could go go wrong so we'll just wait for it to load up so we can see if the uh, if the change occurred and by the way I am running the uh, trigger 3.2 final ROM and uh, there's a review on phonebuff.com if you guys want to check it out for the Samsung Vibrant. Alright, um, looks like this loaded up. Show you my battery icon. As you can see it is different now and uh, it's one that actually matches my theme better so yep that's pretty much it. Um, thank you for watching the video and don't forget to uh, visit phonebuff.com for more cell phone news, reviews, and how-tos.